One two pitch and Barajas hits it into deep left field. Back at the wall it's two nothing Arizona. Rod Barajas who was inserted in the starting lineup for the Diamondbacks. Literally an hour and a half maybe two hours before the game. For Siriano we're not at three so tied at three Rod Barajas. Get your stuff. We're leaving. Walk off. First walk off of his career number four for his season. Rangers win 4 3. 2 2. And it's high in the air. Deep out to right field. That one carrying to the wall and gone. And just like Odor, he deposits one in the seats. Day for a year, parts of three seasons with the Mets, and now a Diamondback. And as Dribble Cabrera gets the D backs on the boards, he knew he got every bit of that one. The only question was fair or foul down that right field line and watching Cabrera's reaction out of the batter's box. He knew it was going to stay fair. Cole Calhoun hits a high fly ball to right field. Mookie Betts is at the wall and it's gone. Diamondbacks answer right back. That's number five for Cole Calhoun. But here at home and he hits this ball in the air out to center field. Long run for Kike Hernandez near the bullpen. That is gone. For Calhoun. Eager gets on, and then Adolis delivers. This ball hit well. That's deep out to left. That one's gone. Top five, Royce Clayton facing Juan Guzman. Gone. Rangers take a 2 1 lead. 423 foot blast for Clayton, fifth on the year. And that was a home run. Range. Still loaded. You can see the overhead shot. Royce Clayton. Grace, Grace's pitch gets by Ramon Hernandez. D backs up 10 9, and then Clayton finishes his business with a two run single. Arizona goes up 12 9. Now top nine, two out. Holding a little bit better all of a sudden. Mets drove in four. Doug Davis gets David Justice. Davis struck out six, and Justice over his last 10. Mench, fortitude, firmness of purpose. He's a Mench. Rob Michelangelo on the fly ball to right. Did you say Mench? I did. That's the man's name. Okay. Davis getting Frank Minichino, who is. And Soriano strikes out. The ball gets away from Chris Snyder, the catcher. And is retired. And the left side of the infield playing very deep and striking out on the curveball. So Ramirez goes chasing again. Two strikeouts in the first inning. Four to two. Fourth inning and an off-speed pitch and Soto goes down swinging one away. Tied up if you had the pinch hitter in there. Third ball in there for strike three. And that'll do a two strikeouts and seven in the game for Doug David. Third, two batters later. Pinch hitter David DeLucci up in smoke. His fourth home run of the year. This one was a three-run jack, and the D-backs win it. DeLucci's homer was Arizona's seventh pinch homer of the season. Dotel is ready, and here it comes. A swing and a line drive right field. Die comes on. He dives. He can't hit it. It's past him. It's all the way to the wall. Michael Young scores. Here comes Jordan around third. He's heading home. The throw to the plate. Not in time. Jordan dives across the plate with the winning run. And the Rangers stream out of the dugout. Deakman trying to keep them in it. Called strike three. And let's see what he's unhappy about. Uh, he might have thought that was a little high. Struck him out with 99 mile per hour heat upstairs. This is. No, oh, he got it, says Tony Randazzo. A little delayed mechanic there. And Deakman strikes out his first batter. As a Diamondback. Well, the one thing about Helen, he changed his seasons around when he started using the changeup a lot more. Helling's 2 2 pitch. Got him. Helling's fastball is in the low 90s, but with the change in the good curve, he can sometimes sneak it past you. Struck him out. So Helling puts two K's in the book in the first, no score after one. Looking the third strikeout for Rick Helling. And he strikes Knobloch out for the second time to strand two. In the first, you know he's coming. Bonds straight up into the air. Hits this about this seven miles play. into the stratosphere. But it's in the playing field. Quentin McCracken makes the catch. Oh, there. 
Bottom four, Bonds second at bat this time. Helling sits him down looking only the 15th time Bonds has struck out all year. Helling says, I'm not overpowering. I can't blow fastballs by folks. I have to rely on control. Bottom seven, shift on for Bonds, but he goes the other way. It's all right, Gonzalez has got time to get there. Bonds 0 for 3 at this point. Called strike three. D-backs get the sweep. And Holland gets the save. Troy Lovello's ball club heads into the All-Star break. A game over 500 tonight. First pitch to Otani. There's a drive to right field. Calhoun turns his back, and it's out of here. Another first pitch homer for Shohei. There's the strikeout. That's two in a row and three in the ball game for Ian Kennedy. Getting an idea of what the rotation will look like down the road. Three strikeouts in a row for Ian Kennedy and four in the game. He rings up Dylan G. There every now and then because I know there's a lot of people watching that are just as old as I am. <laughs> and I might not have much in common. But... There's the one pitch and this one is lifted in the deep center field. But Garcia is there. He makes the play. And the ball game is over. A very nice 3 2 win for the Rangers as they open up this three game series against the Oakland A's. Jeff Mathis sends Bryant back to the wall. It's gone. Jeff Mathis, his first home run since May 15th of last year. B likes pitch, and this one in the air. Out to left field. Tucker was shallow. He's racing way back. Way back. Mathis leaves the yard, a three run shot. Big curveball, strike three call. Bourne swings through that one, and uh, Bourne tried to check, and that is a strikeout to end it. And the Astros are blank for the fifth time. It's the first major league complete game and shutout for Brandon McCarthy. There's the strikeout. First strikeout for Brandon McCarthy. One down here in the third. Came here in a trade from the Tigers last year and he strikes out. Struck him out. Brandon McCarthy is rolling through Miami. First pitch swinging right to Didi Gregorius, and there it is. And Brandon McCarthy has shut out the Marlins. Got him. Big strikeout for Shelby. Two down. He was behind three and one. Got him. Shelby Miller really had to work for it. But he works around two walks in the. To Texas A&M before being drafted and turning pro, and he strikes out Polanco. To win the inning, an eight pitch, top of the first. And he can pitch at this level. He blows away McEwing on three straight pitches, one away. Up there, struck him out on a high fastball, and that'll end the inning. Padilla, perfect seventh with a pair of K's. Alfonso leads at second, swing and a miss, struck him out on three straight pitches, three straight fastballs this time. There it is. Strike three call. Each of the 25 scholars receive a $10,000 college scholarship. As Ortiz strikes out to open up the bottom of the fourth. Baratek strikes out. For the first out here in the bottom of the seventh inning. Fourth K on the day for Padilla. Rosales hits one high in the air to pretty deep left field. Going back to Cespedes. Goodbye. Gonzalez shoots one toward the right field corner, and that ball is gone. Adam Rosales, his trademark sprint around the bases. That's the fifth Diamondback home run tonight. Salta Lamacchia jerks it down the right field line to the pole, off the pole, two run shot. Swinging the bat real well. There's a drive hit way back by Salta Lamacchia. And back at the wall as Harper looks up. It's gone. Home run. Salta Lamacchia, home run here to get the Diamondbacks on the board. It's now two on Washington. They're rocking in Milwaukee. Swing and a miss. That's strike three to Kane. 
The 2-2. Two -two. Bouncing ball. There's your double play yet again. Joe Saunders is a magician. Saunders looking good early on. Bottom one, the Twins have a man at third, two men away. Down goes Oswaldo Arcia. Bottom two, Kirk Suzuki is frozen. And then bottom four, down goes Danny Santana. Saunders would deliver five scoreless innings in this one. First place, Texas Rangers. Yes. As Ian, I hardly had time to speak of the story. Even Millwood had a very good reason, which we will hear. Oh, my goodness. Max Scherzer electric out of the gates. Deep into games. And, Fergie, that's something that we have talked a lot about. Not no. even close. Not if even I, close. If I may, Mark Ray. Here he comes with a one two. It is a fastball and a medium of the house by the side of the road. Takes strike three. And then he has that funky kind of delivery, and the ball stays low. When he's right, hitters think that ball's going to go lower for Max Scherzer. Third consecutive inning, though. The Astros push a run across. Get ready, the 3 1. Round ball to short. Elvis up with it. On the Mormon, and that is a winner. On Washington and uh, Tim Bogart doing the honors in the Rangers dugout of the Rangers. Call strike three. Got him. And a win for Merrill Kelly. Joaquin Soria walked a high wire, but this time he made it across. 5-1 Rangers. Top of the seventh. Runners on second and third. Greg Jeffries, three for three at this point. A tough out for Todd Stodemar. Gets him swinging. Stodemar is loving. Jeffries, bum. Oh, he bats in that leadoff spot, but he's gone swinging. And they're two away in a Giants first inning. His ability to just really cut loose on all his pitches like he did on that curveball. Impressive first inning by Stottlemyre. We move to the second, no score. Completely dominated National League hitting this year. There, strike three to Snow. He didn't like it. A similar pitch to the one Stottlemyre was called out on when he was batting in the top of the third. Fastball. But instead... Joe Aldebelli was chosen. That ball dropped. Stanley's got to throw him out at first and can't find the handle on it. Oh. Struck him out. That's the third strike out of the inning. He did it. Four strikeouts in an inning. Second start of the season. First was April 7th. In the top of the first with two on, two out. He gets J.T. Snow to pop out. And he gets great counsel to hustle get him out of the inning. Top third, no score, two out. Witt to Barry Bonds. Not fishing, but he looked at the hook. Bottom five.